Hello, Task Force. Uh, I'm going to talk to you today about uh, respecting your skills uh, for cruisers. Uh, excellent for tactical and engineers, pretty much. S science and iffy. But anyone that flies a cruiser or uh, escort, this spec will pretty much work pretty well for you. Um, give you the setup. Starship, you know, Starship attack pattern. I put in eight points in there. Uh, Starship weapons training. I put eight points. Starship energy weapons. Eight points. Starship maneuvers. Eight. Uh, Starship targeting systems. Eight. And Starship energy weapon specialization. Eight. And the engineering section. Uh, I, I use batteries, so that's my thing with me. So I use five points in there. Starship hull plating. Eight. Starship integrity. Seven. Starship subsystem repair. Eight. Uh, Starship Warp Core Efficiency, 8. Uh, Starship Electroplasma Systems, I put in 8. Uh, Starship Impulse Thruster, 6. Starship Warp Core Potential, 8. Starship Engine Performance, 6. Starship Hull Plating, 7. Starship Shield Performance, 6. And Starship Weapons Performance, 3. On my uh, Science, uh, Starship flow capacitor, six. Starship shield emitters, maxed out all nine points. Starship power insulator, eight. Starship shield systems, eight, nine, maxed out. I use Starship inertial dampener, six. Starship sensors, five. Um, I'll tell you two reasons. This is important. Starship flow capacitor, and I'll show you why. Uh, when you go to this ship. Why I use that one is for the plasmatic leech. Plasmonic leech. Um, it's extremely important for that when you're shooting. It will drain more um, energy from the other ship and give it to you. I go up as high as 19 points for each subsystem. So that can help you in pretty much any match. The other thing is that everyone, and I mean everyone who flies any ship, should get this uh, inertial dampener guy. All right, he increases plus 40 to all energy damage resistance for 23 seconds. Uh, get this doff um, or a blue one, a must-have, um, and then you have to use the power uh, auxiliary to inertial dampeners. But a must-have for any ship. Um, so that's the specs for any cruiser. Um, and pretty much it works for escorts too, but for tactical engineering, that's a good setup. Science, I can't help you too much on there, guys. Alright, any other questions, uh, let me know, and I'll make more videos in the future. Bye-bye.